President of Marathon Bahamas, Brian Moody, says that the goal of Marathon Bahamas is threefold, to promote healthy lifestyles, to raise funds for designated charities, and also to promote tourism during a historically dry period. The first year was uh, February, we did it over Valentine's weekend. And last, week, last year, or this year, 2011, we did it over the Martin Luther King weekend in January. Um, so historically a very quiet time of the year for tourism. We've found that we've actually managed to turn that around a little and with more than, last year we, we, um, we drove more than 2,000 room nights during that weekend. And this year it looks like we've already surpassed that as far as registrations from overseas are concerned. Now in its third year of existence, Marathon Bahamas has refined a few items of this Boston qualifying event. Ongoing road works have also made it necessary to leave the exact finalizing of the course until December. We cannot finalize the course until early December and hopefully by then we'll know that come mid-January when the race is, 14th and 15th of January, we'll know roughly which roads are prepared, which roads are ready and which roads aren't. So the route is going to change slightly this year, inevitably because of the change of the, of the roads, but Predominantly it's going to be the same route because it's a route that the feedback that we've got from participants, both local and more importantly from the tourism's point of view, internationally, the feedback we've, we've had on the route is that it's second to none. You know, these people have ran all over the world and they come here and they run down the coast and it's just such beautiful, uh, the sea, the beach, the sand, everything else, and they just love it. So that's why we've seen a growth, a significant growth in international participation. So there's going to be a slight change to the route, but not significant. We're going to, you know, we're still going to be starting at Junkanoo Beach. We're still going to go over the bridges, go down to Montague, come back down Shirley Street. But again, we might, and then go again past Arawak, all the way out west to close to somewhere around Compass Point, maybe just beyond Compass Point, depending upon the course measurement again, and then back and finishing at Arawak Key. To register, volunteer, or become a sponsor, go to www. .marathonbahamas.com For the Tourism Today Network, I'm Gina Seeley.